Hello and welcome to Droix. Today we are checking out the B-Link GK35 budget priced mini PC. We will be unboxing it, taking a closer look at the device's features and then putting it through its paces with some system benchmarks. As always, let's get started with the unboxing. First, we have the B-Link GK35 Mini PC, which we will take a closer look at in a moment. Underneath is a user manual, which is in multiple languages, including English, German, Spanish and Italian. Inside the packaging is a power supply. We will include the correct adapter for your country when ordering. There's a HDMI cable for connecting to your monitor or TV. And last but not least are some screws for when installing a 2.5 inch hard drive or SSD inside the device. The B-Link GK35 measures 4.52 by 4.01 by 1.65 inches and weighs 261 grams. On the front are two USB 3 ports, a 3.5mm headphone jack and power button. On the back are two additional USB 3 ports, a gigabit Ethernet port and two HDMI ports for dual monitor support. You can open the bottom via the four screws on the corners to upgrade the RAM and storage and also to install the 2.5 inch hard drive or SSD to further expand the storage. The B-Link features the Intel Celeron J3455 processor which has 4 cores and 4 threads running up to 2.3 GHz. There's 8 gigs of DDR3 RAM and a choice of 128 or 256 gigs of M.2 SATA SSD. Wireless connectivity is handled with Wi-Fi 5 and Bluetooth 4.0. Energy efficiency is a great factor, running at just 10 watts TDP. We start off the system benchmarks with Passmark. Passmark stress tests the CPU, GPU, RAM and storage to its maximum in a series of artificial performance tests. The B-Link GK35 scores 780 points. They are far from being great scores, but do remember this is a low cost, energy efficient mini PC. PC Mark performs a series of tests of more day to day usage tasks, which includes web browsing, working with office documents, through to video decoding. The GK35 scores 1407. They are decent scores for a mini PC of this specification and will certainly be able to cope with these day to day tasks. 3D Mark runs a series of tests for the CPU and GPU to see its performance for tasks including gaming, but it's also useful for video decoding for example. The GK35 scores 112. Again, this score is good for the specification, but it is only suitable for media consumption. You would not be able to play any games with it. A quick recap of the scores now. For a budget mini PC, it is a reasonable price versus performance ratio. The GK35 is suitable for your day-to-day -day home and office tasks, such as web browsing, media consumption and office work. It is ideal as a low cost, energy efficient mini PC. That wraps up this review of the B-Link GK35 mini PC. We hope you have found it useful. You can learn more and buy the GK35 on our store at droix.co.uk. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and we hope to see you in our next video.